Hello and welcome guys, this is the second video in the series Get Response Affiliate Marketing and today we are going to have a quick overview of finding the right affiliate product to promote, where you can look for those and then we're going to jump in and build a funnel using Get Response. So the first part of this, if you haven't already seen that first video, make sure you hit the link in the description below and go and check out the first video where I'll show you how to set up your free Get Response account. If you haven't got one already, there'll also be a link below so you can go and get yourself a free Get Response account. And then we're going to move on to today's video. Before we can set up our landing page, we need to have a product to promote. Now there's a whole host of different places you can find products. You can go direct to product creators. You you can go to affiliate networks, you can go all over the place to find affiliate products. You can even go to places like Amazon and places like that. If you're looking at digital products, then I'm going to show you some of my recommended affiliate networks. First off, you've got Digistore24. This is completely free to sign up, guys. All you need to do is go over to Marketplace and go to All Offers on the Marketplace. You can search down the left-hand side for whatever niche it is you're in. Then we're going to search down the list and find the product that suits us. Now, you want to look at the sort of commissions you're going to make, how much commission, your average earnings. We also want to look at the cart conversion rates, how well they are converting the leads that you're sending in, and the cancellation rate as well, because we want the lowest cancellation rate possible and the highest cart conversion rate, that means you're going to make more money from the people that you're sending over to those products. Now, before we have a look at the others, my top recommendation if you're looking to promote an affiliate product is to make sure that it's a good quality product. If you go out there and start promoting poor quality products, you're going to burn your list, you're going to burn your audience very, very quickly. And if you do that, all of the hard work you put in to the traffic side of your business, driving traffic to that landing page that we're going to create in a minute, is wasted because they're just going to disappear. They won't trust you anymore. And the only way to really know if the product is good is to go and buy it and consume it. Now, not all the time you have to buy it. You can you know, request affiliate access to some of these products if you have a track record. There's places like uh, Munchai where, where you can go and see if you can get affiliate review access for products and certain places like that. But always go and buy the product, consume it, make sure it's good quality before you promote it to your list. The next one, we've got ClickBank. I'm sure you've heard of this. You can go and check on their marketplace. You can find you know, the top products. Again, there's a whole host of different niches on the left-hand side. And we wanna do the same sort of process. We're gonna look at the average earnings, what commission we're gonna make, you know, that sort of thing. Then we've got JVZoo, that's another one where you can go and find affiliate digital products that you can go and promote. All of these are free to sign up for, guys, um, but some of them you have to apply to become an affiliate and they'll only let certain people in. So just be aware of that before we get started. Then you've got Warrior Plus as well. These are the biggest ones. These are the ones where you're gonna sort of probably start. But for the purpose of this video, we are using GetResponse to build our affiliate business, so why not promote GetResponse? Become a partner with GetResponse and earn a commission through you promoting them. Now, you can go and sign up for that for free. All you wanna do is search GetResponse Affiliate Program and you can come to this page over here and you can see there's two different options you've got. We've got Affiliate Recurring Program, so you get 33% commission every single month that someone keeps paying their subscription. Now, remember that GetResponse is a free software to start with. It's got a freemium structure to it, so people come in for free. You're not gonna earn any money from the free program, but if people grow their businesses, which you want, and they stick around, they're gonna start paying a monthly fee to get response, and you're gonna get 33% of that. This is the one I recommend. You can also go for the $100 bounty program, where every lead that you send in that signs up for a paid account, you get $100 per sound. Now this sounds good, and it means that you can make more money quicker, but you get no recurring commission. So if you think someone's paying you know, $40 a month and you're gonna get 33% of that, it's only gonna take you a few months before you start to build up to this $100. And then once it goes past that, it's all pure profit, guys. So I would recommend the recurring program. Go and sign up for this, it's free to sign up, and then you can go and grab yourself an affiliate link. So back inside GetResponse, the first thing we need to do before we set up our landing page is we need to create a list. We're gonna go over to contacts here we're going to go into lists and you can see i've got a whole host of different test lists that i've got down here we're going to create a new list 
and you're going to give it a name and create that list. It's that simple. Now there's some settings to go through. I'm not going to create another list because I've got one here. This get response opt-in. This is the one I'm going to use for the purpose of this video. When you create this list, you're going to come through to these settings here. You can give the list a title, description. This is for your purpose. You can give it a category, change the language. You can add a logo in here so people can see that. And also so they can click on that logo and head over to a URL that you put in here. You could use that as a potential to put in another affiliate link you've also got your subscription settings which is your, going to be your double opt-in settings and all of that stuff all this you don't need to worry too much about this you've also got confirmation message if you do a double opt-in you want them to send the confirmation we're not going to use any of that so don't worry all we're going to do is set up the the list so we can connect it to our funnel next thing up on the tools on the left hand side here we're going to come down to landing pages and inside the free version you can use this feature for free guys and you can see i've got a couple in here that i've used before this is one that i set up for get response in the past and you can see that it's a very very nice looking landing page we've got our legal pages at the bottom here i've got a video on this particular page here now if you want to go above and beyond and you want to make sure that you give your subscribers and your leads as much value as possible i always recommend putting a video on the landing page it's just going to give that extra little touch and build that personal brand that is really going to help you accelerate your success with affiliate marketing but we're keeping it simple we're not going to build a page like this it's going to be very similar to this but we're going to remove the video we're just going to have a headline like this we're going to have a sub headline we've got our opt-in page here and we get our button so they can go through and sign up for a get response account remember we're promoting get response so back over to our tools and we're going to create a landing page very very simple guys as soon as you hit create it's going to take you through to a whole host of different templates there are loads and loads of templates you can use here and again this is going to be down to personal preference whatever you think looks good but some of these are very very detailed very complicated landing pages and we don't want that we want something as simple as possible so we're going to scroll down till we find one that suits our needs this one here is nice and simple it's got a headline it's got an opt-in page that is all we need guys we're going to select this template you can give it a name you've also got a thank you page here but we're not going to worry about a thank you page you can go if you want to use if you're going to run ads on facebook and place that you need to have a thank you page and they provide that feature we don't need that all we want is the landing page because we're going to send them directly onto our affiliate link from here hit next step and this is going to take us over to landing page builder where we can start to adapt and change this design for whatever purpose we deem fit. So as you can see here, you can click and adapt and change all of these buttons here, including the image at the back. Now, if you wanna change the image at the back, all we're gonna do is double click that, and you can see this button at the top here, that's gonna bring up our solid color, we can add a gradient, or we can add an image. Now you can see it's already got an image in here, we can remove that, we can choose a new image, and this is gonna take you through to your files where you've got a load of images. You've also got my websites and you've got free get response images so they have a package of images here and they've got shutterstock gallery as well and we can go and search for an image here and you see loads and loads of images so you don't need to go and use something like canva you don't need any other tools you can use one that you think looks good we're going to select this one see how it looks on the page and you see that doesn't look particularly good on the page there so i'm going to remove that i'm going to go back i'm going to go over to get response images again now you want the image nice and simple guys. You can see that uh, this is pretty simple. We don't want to distract from the information we're putting on the page. So the next part is we need to adapt and change the headline and the subheading so that it gives people information. Why should they click on your link and go and check out the offer that you're giving them? So the top bit here, we don't need any of that. So we're gonna delete it. The next part, so Get Response is an all-in-one marketing automation tool and you can get it for free. So that's a big plus there. So we're gonna put free at the front. Now you can change the colors if you like. All you need to do is highlight the section you wanna change the color on. We can select maybe a blue color. We can also change the text if we wanna change the text style as well. Maybe something like that. I don't like that one. And ideally we want the headline all on one row. You can see that we can drag and drop all of the parts that we need. This text here needs to be black because we can't see it. So just drag it down to there, hit OK. That's now black and we want to change this. So again, now we've changed the headline and the subheadline. We need to change the button text and I'm gonna change this image as well because you can tell it just doesn't look that great. With a button, 
text, uh, the button color, all we need to do is go to there, and I recommend something like a blue color. Change the call to action to get instant access. You can see that we've got a hover feature as well, which is added in there, which is really nice. This bottom bit here, we don't need, we're gonna remove that. Now you can add legal pages, I recommend you do that, but until you've got some legal pages, you don't need to put any footers and stuff on there. If you wanna find out how to create legal pages, there's websites online that will write them all for you. It's really, really simple. You can host them on GetResponse as well. Nice and easy to do, but don't worry too much. Now, as I said, it don't, doesn't look that great with the rear image, so I'm gonna change that again. And I think that one looks a lot better, but obviously now we need to go back in and we need to change the text color to white so that it stands out. If we change it all to white, highlight that again, and we're gonna make it blue again. This text here, we're gonna change to white. You can see just how simple it is to use the get response landing page builder, and that is it, guys. So it looks really simple. It is, that is a landing page built. Now, don't overthink it. You wanna keep it nice and simple. Remember, you're gonna pre-sell what you're promoting in your content, the traffic side. Now, we haven't discussed that in this series, we are gonna discuss it later on in the series once we've set everything up. But if you wanna find out more about getting traffic, you can find that right here on the School of Affiliates YouTube channel. Just go and have a look at some of the other videos where I recommend different traffic sources and how to drive traffic and the best ways to do it. Next thing, we wanna make sure the mobile optimization is correct and you can see that it is not. So we need to change and adapt that for mobile optimization. We're gonna reduce the text size there. We're gonna make sure everything lines up. That looks pretty good. You could adjust and change this, but I'm not gonna mess around too much. Once we're happy, we're gonna hit save and it's done. Once we've done that, we're gonna go next step. Remember, we don't need a thank you page, so we're not gonna worry about that. We're going next step again, because we are gonna direct people straight onto the affiliate offer. Now, this is where we're gonna add all of the details, add our affiliate link and all of that stuff. So you got the page page title, the meta description. We don't need to worry about that. This is all to do with if you're trying to rank this page on Google, we're not doing that. Then you've got your subdomain for get response or you can set up your own domain we discussed that in the first video how to set up your own custom domain i highly recommend that you do that if you're serious about building an affiliate marketing business you need to build a brand around your business that's the only way you're going to find success and you're not going to do it with a url that looks like that so we want to find our domain we're going to select this one for instance money dot school or affiliates and we can add a directory if we want. I'm not gonna worry about that now. You can also add a new domain directly from here. It makes it really simple. You've also got to change domain settings and add the C name entry. That's the information on how to do it. I shared that all in the last video, guys. Then we've got our list. We need to choose the list that we want to send it to. We set that up at the beginning of this video. Mine's a get response opt-in. I'm gonna select that. And then we've got a confirm opt-in. Now this is our double opt-in, guys, that get response will do. This has some advantages and disadvantages. If you put this on, it means that people will not get added to your list until they go into their email account and they confirm that they've signed up for your landing page. Now, what this does is if you get people that put in their spam email addresses and email addresses they don't use because they've got no intention of ever getting the, the software, it will remove those from your list so that they your open rates will be improved and all that stuff. So it has a lot of advantages. But through the process of setting up our get response account, we are going to pre-qualify those people. We are going to follow up with emails. And if they don't respond to those emails, we're going to make sure we get rid of them off our list ourselves. So I never add this in. I do the process manually because I find that some people don't go in and they, they might forget for a couple of days. And by the time they come back, they've missed the opportunity they've lost the email for this confirmation and you've lost a potential lead there whereas if they sign up and they do come through to your emails then you can send your promotional emails later on you've got a much better chance of re-engaging that lead so i always leave that off you can add it into a cycle on a day so when we set up our emails later on and we're setting up uh, an email autoresponder, you can select which day you want them to be added in. If you want them to miss the first day, second day, whatever, it doesn't matter. We're not going to do this because we want to add them in on day one. We want to start sending out promotional emails straight away as soon as they sign up. Then you've got to see here our thank you page. This is the default one that we didn't edit when we've done our landing page. We are not going to send them to that. We're sending them to a custom thank you page. And this is where we can add our affiliate link. So when you go and sign up for your Get Response Affiliate program, you're going to get your own 
custom URL that you can use to promote GetResponse. We're going to go and copy that and we're going to paste it right into there. Simple as that, guys. We're done, guys. We hit publish and that saves our page and that is it finished. Now you can go and have a look at the page. You can see the URL here and this is what our page looks like. Once someone puts their name in, email address, and hits get instant access, they're gonna get taken through. You can go and test this yourself, and you can see that takes me through to here, where I can go and sign up for my free get response account. Then we come back inside, we can go over to our contacts, we can make sure that's gone into our list. You can see our get response opt-in list here, and there's now one contact. That is me, I've tested it, it works. And from here, we can set up our email promotions, and we can automate all of that and we can do it using our free get response account. If you're following along with me guys, make sure you go and grab yourself a free get response account by hitting the link below this video. That is an affiliate link guys, but it's a free account. I don't earn anything from it until you find success and you start paying for account. But in the next video guys, I'm gonna start to talk about those emails. We're gonna put together our email automations. We're gonna start putting all of our emails together. I'm going to show you how to write emails, how to structure them, how to set them up so they're automated and you can start making money while you sleep. Make sure you hit the subscribe button notification bell so YouTube can let you know when that video is released and I'll see you on the next video.